Hi, this is Steve Dockery and welcome back to the Moot Workshop. Today we're taking a look at an iMac G4 from 2002. This 18 year old computer has a DVRW drive in it, but if you put a disc in, nothing happens. It doesn't read it. We're gonna try and diagnose and repair the problem this time on the Moot Workshop. So let's uh, try this out here. We'll put a disc in there and see what happens. Spinning up. It's trying. Chug, chug, chug. Still trying. And it's given up. And it does this with any disc you try, so it's not this particular disc. All right, let's see what it thinks it has. It has a Pioneer DVD RW, but it's obviously not working. Now, repairing the actual drive is not a thing that's in my wheelhouse, but we can replace it. This is the exact model of drive that's used in the machine, purchased, used on eBay. Now we have to assume that them saying it was tested and functional is true. All right, I already have another video about how to actually open up one of these. So if you want the specifics of that, zip over to that other video. Otherwise, we're just going to speed through this. So now, this is where the optical drive is. This whole unit is kind of a stack. Um, to get to this, I'm going to disconnect some connections. That's the, that's the antenna for the Wi-Fi. And this is the cable to the display. Just take the, the cover off of it and sneak that loose. Um, now I need to get this whole drive bay out of here. Torx T15, just like we used for the bottom. I almost started taking the speaker out. Remember, the ones on the shield are shorter. This is the hard drive. There's the optical drive, power supply, cooling fan, speaker, and incredible amounts of dust and hair. Eh. Back in a few minutes after I've cleaned all this up. There we go. Not spotless, but something a person can work on without wearing a hazmat suit. I'm going to unplug the power from the hard drive. You notice they've put this white contact paper basically on the hard drive so you can't see a little bit of it through the fan. It's a, it's a kind of a funny, almost excessive uh, look and feel thing. There's this whole thing attached to the bottom of the drive that's going to have to get peeled off and stuck on this one.
Now we detach the power and the data cables. These are Torx T8. Now we just took it all back up again. Alright, let's see how we did. Well, I'm going to play a 20-year-old computer game. See you next time here at the Moot Workshop. Hi, thanks for watching. If you really liked that video, please click the like button. And if you like what we do in general, please subscribe because that not only lets YouTube know that you like us, but it also lets you know when we have a new video and we do post a new video every week. Uh, and if you really want to encourage this behavior, head on over to our Patreon because your contributions will help us get exhibits for the museum, but more importantly, it'll help buy us parts and supplies that we need to refurbish and otherwise restore these items so that they work and they're in the best condition they can be. Thanks again.